Hello everyone. Welcome to All Complete Exam. Today we will be learning one of the most important chapter from reasoning and the chapter is Dyson Cube. Now this is a very important chapter and you will be getting some questions from this chapter. And it is very easy to solve all these questions in very quick time. So what I, I will be suggesting you is to please watch this video till the end so that you can get to know each and every tricks that I will be discussing in this video and if you like this video then please do share with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe our channel all right and one more thing please take a blank sheet and keep on taking some notes along with me as I will be doing in this video all right so without any delay let's begin now in this video I will be discussing about cube and then I will be discussing dice all right now see what is a cube like in a cube you will getting all sides are equal all right so this is a cube and here all these sides are equal and the sides is 5 centimeter in case of a cuboid the sides are not equal that is not in our syllabus so you don't have to worry about that I am just discussing in case if you are interested what is the difference between cube and cuboid so a cuboid in cuboid sides are not equal in cube all sides are equal so that is the main difference now cube is in our syllabus so we will be dealing with only cubes so see here these sides are equal and in the questions that generally comes is so these are the type of question that can come from cube and the question is a cube of 5 cm is cut into equal halves of 1 cm each the opposite phase are colored with red, blue and green respectively. Now, you need to say what is the total number of cube formed. Alright, so this is the first question and similarly there can be another questions like uh, in how, uh, how many cubes are, will be there uh, having three faces painted. So these are the questions we will be discussing each and every questions along with tricks. So keep watching. So a cube of 5 cm is cut into equal herbs. Of one centimeter so one centimeter I'm considering so one two three four five we, we cut this cube into five equal halves by taking one centimeter similarly it will be something like this when we cut this on uh, height and it will be 3 4 5 similarly it will go like this over here and similarly there will be another 5 equal parts So here we go. So we have cut this cube of 5 cm into 5 equal herbs. This is one face, this is another face, this is another face. Alright, so there are total how many phase? Phase face means this is one phase. This is another phase, this is another phase. Similarly, at the back side of this, there will be another three more phases. So, total there are six phases. Alright. And how many edges are there? Edge means what? This is an edge. This is an edge. This is an edge. This is an edge. Alright. So, this is another edge. This is another edge. This is another edge. So, edge means something like this the end of the figure all right so so there are 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and there will be another 3 at the back side so together you will be getting 12 edges all right and how many corners are there corner means with vertices so this is a vertex this is another vertex so there are 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and here will be another 8 all right so there are total 8 vertices or corners 
all right so here is the main thing you need to remember so in a cube there are eight corners 12 edges and six faces all right so now you need to answer this question and and the statement is the opposite faces are colored with red blue and green respectively so they colored this phase as blue this phase as green this phase as green all right and this phase as red so all this sorry all these faces are colored with green all right so all these faces are colored with green these faces are colored with red and these faces are colored with blue now what is the total number of cube formed when we cut it into equal halves how many cube will be forming so basically here we need to find the volume now we know the height is 5 centimeter the length is 5 centimeter and the breadth is 5 centimeter since it is a cuboid all the sides are equal now the volume means what length cube so here it is 5 centimeter so 5 centimeter into 5 centimeter into 5 centimeter so together you will be getting 125 all right so here is the formula or tricks that you need to remember so total number of cube formed is equal to 5 by 1 into cube so here 5 is the total length of the cube all right so length of the cube and 1 is in how many centimeter we require to cut it so here it is the cut one is the cut so you will be getting 125 all right so we can denote it so that is equal to 5 q that is n if you consider so we'll be getting 125 all right now see we are considering this 5 cube as n so that we can derive the formula for my next problem that i'll be showing you right now so the volume total volume is the number of side is the number of cube since it is cut by one centimeter only only one unit all right now let's suppose the question states that it is cutting into two centimeter okay so if if it say the question by two centimeter say then you need to write this two over here that is five by two whole cube so the final answer will be that thing only all right so it is quite simple now see how many cubes are there having three faces painted so what it means is how many cubes will be there whose all the three faces will be painted so here this is one face this is a, another face and the back side of this is another face if you consider this cube this is one face this is another face this is another face so in this cube you can see the three faces are painted one two three three faces are painted similarly all these corners all this corner cube three faces are painted all right so basically when they ask how many cubes are there having three faces painted they are actually asking how many corners are there so here the corner is eight always remember in every cube the corners are always eight always remember so here the answer is just eight corners since 8 is the total number of corner in a cube all right now see the next question how many cubes are they are having two faces painted so the question asks is how many cube will be there having only two faces painted not three this time they are asking only two so what it means is just see these type of cubes this is m1 this is one this is one here only two faces are painted this side and this side in this cube you will be getting these sides are painted but here only two sides are painted and these sides are these sides are 
not painted they are unpainted so basically they are seeing only two side so one two three four five one two three four five six similarly one two three four five six so and you'll be getting this thing over here as well and this thing over here as well so basically how many cubes are there so what is the formula the formula is n minus 2 into number of ages now see I am discussing this formula so n is what n is the side side by cut all right so n means length of the cube by cut means in uh, in how many equal halves we need to cut so n is that thing only so here it is n is 5 so here 5 minus 2 that means 3 so here 1 2 3 you are getting and see this is age I told earlier now this is an age so this thing into ages 3 into 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and another 3 at the back so basically there are 12 edges so all you need to do is to multiply this 3 into all these edges so what we will be getting is n minus 2 into edges so here it is 5 minus 2 into edges is how many 12 edges always remember in every cube the number of edges is 12 only so 5 minus 2 into 12 that is 3 into 12 that is finally 36 very simple now now let's see the next question how many cubes are there having only one face painted so now they are asking how many cubes will be there whose only one face is painted so if you see in this cube only one face not two not three so this is a cube 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 this is another cube this is another cube and this is another cube so basically this cube if you see carefully they having only one face painted they neither have two faces painted or three faces painted they have got only one faces painted and that face is only this face only and you will be getting this face in all the sides all the all these faces all right so basically there are so the formula that we can derive from is from this is n minus 2 whole square into faces very simple n is what n is the length of the cube by cut so here n is 5 only so 5 minus 2 since we are eliminating these sides and these sides only they are having two sides painted now so n minus 2 that is 5 minus 2 so 3 now whole square square why whole square because you will be getting always this cube number always the square number of cubes over here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so 3 square is what 9 so always you will be getting this number of cube is in square terms so so n minus 2 whole square is what is required so 5 minus 2 into number of faces why because this is the one face this is another face this is another face the back side of this is another face here is another face so basically there are how many faces six there will be always six faces in a cube so all you need to do is to multiply this by six so what you'll be getting is three square into six that is nine into six equal to fifty four that is what they wanted all right you get to know now now let's see the final question and the question is how many cubes are there having zero faces painted so they are, they are now asking how many cubes are there whose faces are not painted at all so you need to find the cubes that are practically inside of this that are practically inside and it is not a hollow cube so so they will be having all these cubes inside of this of this cube alright those are not painted so the formula is n minus 2 whole cube equal to 5 minus 2 whole cube equal to 27 now see why why this cube see as you all know that there are basically 3 there are basically 9 cubes in each face whose are having only one side painted now just after that cube you will be getting another phase of cube where 
they don't have any side painted so we'll be getting is one two three one two three this slide this slide and this side and this side there will be a bunch of cubes whose neither sides are painted so you'll be getting this cube thing all right in this way so it is n minus 2 whole cube and that is 5 minus 2 whole cube equal to 27 is what the required number of cubes whose faces are 0 so that is this 27 is the number of cubes who have no faces as painted so that is the five types of question that can come from this chapter cube we will be discussing dice in our next video so hopefully you have really get to know about all these tricks in this video so if you like this video then please do like this video and also do share with your friends and if you have any difficulty then please do comment in our comment sections so that we can help you guys so all the very best and thank you very much for watching this video